What's up deputies, Officer First 30 Minutes here. Today I'm showing you how to install police radio for LSPDFR. This is one of the most used mods in my patrols. I highly recommend this mod. So police radio lets you plate check, call the coroner, call tow trucks, uh, tackle suspects, request pit, uh, put up barriers, request additional traffic units, and request canines to come in to sniff cars for drugs so let's go ahead and download this file and whenever you're downloading stuff for your specific lspdfr you want to make sure it correlates to the rage hook you're on if it doesn't it can cause compatibility issues so as you see this one is for 0.37 which is the rage hook we are running so it's a small download let's go ahead and open that along with our gta 5 directory so it's very simple you just need to drag and drop this into here. So you go into plugins, LSPDFR. Once again, make sure to unblock all these files. Here's the .ini, you can set your name. So I like to set it to first 30 minutes. Uh, 10 code, 1028, play audio. Um, you can change it if you have the core box full installed and then here are just all 10 codes. It's very highly customizable and it is supported with controllers. So we'll boot into the game and make sure it all loads up. We are in the game now. Let's go ahead and force duty. We are now on duty. Let's go ahead and pull it up. I'm going to connect my Xbox One controller real quick. And there it is. You can see it is up in the lower right hand of the screen. Let's go ahead and run over here and run a play check on one of these cars just to verify it is working. Yep, Ingot plate number 29, Jacob Ocean Queen 172. Awesome. If you guys enjoyed this tutorial, leave me a like and I'll see you on the next episode.